Devastator hate Neon! Devastator smash not Constructicons! Hello, this is KR Brickbot, and now that I've reviewed all the construction Hello Carbots, I'll be combining them into Buildian and Hyper Buildian. First, you need to combine Zesty and Proud into Proud Zet, so I'll do that real quick. And another thing I'd like to mention about Proud is, I think it would have made more sense if this truck was a giant earth mover kind of truck like Constructicon long haul but but instead we have this oversized kitty sized truck Okay, then you take Blaster here and split him into five pieces. So what you do here for the feet is you fold this down and then attach it to these white milky pieces here. And at least on my copy, these four clips are rather loose. So you really need to secure it with this. And do that for the other leg. And I think on this leg it's especially loose. Now you're given proud big blue boots. Then take these apart and then um, these kibble, these bits really don't have any specific position so you can just position them like this or this however you like. And then attach them to these holes and clip here. And then you slot this horn piece that becomes his like his crown for building here. Yes, we're almost done, but now you just you take Starby here. Then you transform her. Like so. Wait. Okay, pull that out and then flip it 180. Actually you need to extend this for building here. And then fold it out like this. Go to the back and then attach Starby to this hole and clip here. And then you can flip out these caterpillar beam lasers. And there you have Buildian. So all Buildian is is really is Proud Zet with blasters, boots and drills and a crown and basically all sorts of accessories attached to Proud Zet. And that makes them even bigger, but uh, just how big? Okay, well here's Unite Warriors Bruticus. And you can see there's a bigger height boost. Then Hello Carbot Zetwin. So if if Proud is the main s accurate scale here, he would be a leader class size among a deluxe class. And then there's the big one. Combiner Wars Devastator.
Yes, it seems that Billion stands about two heads shorter than Devastator, but we can give Billion some more height. Okay, and now we can add Duke and Cran to the mix. Okay, first you detach the this. And uh, one thing of note, I think this kind of peg here, over time, it could get squashed together and become loose. So be wary of that. Okay, and then fold this out and flip this down so that the wheels won't roll around. Do the same for Cran. Now the tricky part. Okay, then flip this. Attach Duke with it backwards like this. And then flip down the foot even more. And then flip that out. Do the same for the other foot. And now if you've got even taller boots. Okay, for the shoulders, you see, you can just uh, flip these up and make sure the wheels lock into some ridges. And then just plonk Duke and Cran like this. So apparently giving Buildian boots and shoulders turns him into hyper billion and deepens his voice somehow. So now how big is he? Yes, now Bruticus is much shorter than this now. And as for Devastating. He still the hyper building still stands stands about one head shorter than Devastator, but counting the beams and the horns here, he is the same height as Devastator now. Since each of the construction car bots are different colors, like putting them all together makes them have a rather hodgepodge color scheme with like with basically big red with blue boots and green and yellow sides. And on the back, he does have these unsightly robot leg kibble. And yet that bulldozer back. And it is looking rather sparse. And because it's heavy, I think the ratchet hip joints aren't that strong enough to give a good weight if tossed around. And also, as I mentioned before, these clips fall off very easy, so if you're not careful, that could just fall right off. So there really is no increased articulation since it's all just proud sets. But you could fiddle around with it, like just drill here. And you can fold these back if you want. Or if you really want to, you could have a robot stand on top of this.
Yep, that just looks plain ridiculous. In conclusion, Hyper Buildian is not so much a true combiner as one bot with power up stuck all over him. But I think his size does make him a good, nice counterpart to the Transformers Combiner Wars Devastator here. So I do like putting them, pitting them against each other. So if you really want a big bot for to oppose your Titans, Transformers, Devastator, or Predakings, uh, I think this is a good choice. Although. Getting all of this together overseas would cost about $300 to $400 plus shipping. As for over here in Korea, I think you can event occasionally find used listings for about around $100 Korean one or so. So while the retail price is about 200 Korean one. But it is a rather simple combiner but still very imposing and big. That's it for this review. Be sure to sound off in the comments and be sure to like and subscribe.